Okay, beekeepers, we're here at Leonardo's. There's a swarm trap right here with some bees in it. One of the good ways to get bees is if you set up a swarm trap. They like voids, you know, open spaces that are dark and not too hot, not too cold, so it's perfect for them. Bees go in it, and then if you get there soon enough, you can just shake them out into a new hive, but they've been here a week or so. You can also set up a nuke box with frames in it, which is good. I like that better, actually, because it's less work. But, you know, live and learn. Well, the swarm trap has been here since last summer. And after our last group meeting, I went down and I put some honeycomb and honey in the, in the swarm trap. And lo and behold, a week later, uh, that, that colony moved in. Oh, the whole thing's full of comb. The thing with swarm traps is they're easy for them to fill it up. So in a month or six or eight weeks, they could be ready to swarm again because they're crowded. So you should pay more attention to them than I do. But you know, I'm so broke, I haven't even been able to pay attention. <laughs> the hardest thing is to get the first couple combs out. Then it's easier. See, the new comb is really soft, so it's hard to pull out. Okay, what we got here now, they kind of go into shock when you cut their hive apart. They're in a cluster now, so we're going to put this box over where it was in the tree, and then we're going to take the swarm trap over and shake them into the new hive here. Now the key is, is not to have them fly up your pant legs. Did they go in? Looks like they did. Okay. We're going to leave them here for a few days because they're really oriented to this location. Let them put everything together, start drawing some more comb, get to Queen Lane again because it's kind of a shock. And then we'll tape the lid down and put some cheesecloth at the entrance and we'll take them. I, I think these are going to Culver City. That's kind of how you do a removal from a swarm trap. You know, good, bad, or ugly, that's how we do it. And remember, Backwards is the new forwards. <laughs> Thank you for your support.